Hello friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Michaela, and I make adult coloring and diamond painting videos here on this channel. And today I have a super exciting unboxing video for you guys. Today I will be unboxing my next diamond painting kit that I want to work on, and that is Moon Girlfriend by the lovely Ivy Dolamore. Hopefully this will Hopefully this will focus. Oh, look at that beautiful artwork. I absolutely love this piece. I am very excited to unbox it. Um, today <laughs> is actually Friday, December 29th, okay? And I am not planning on uploading this video until like the 8th of January. Um, so I am very much pre-filming this video and that is because I am getting to a point in my current whip. I have a row and a half left and I figure I wanna let this kit sit out and flatten a little bit before I get started on it. On top of that, I already have a bunch of year-end videos I want to get up before, um, just like at the end of December, beginning of January, so this is just kind of what it fit in. I might end up switching some things around, this might get up earlier, but as of right now, it's planned to go up in like a week. <laughs> so um, I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing video, and let's get right on into it. Okay, so like I said, this is Moon Girlfriend by Ivy Dolamore. This is a round kit, you can tell because it has a little circle right here and it's pink. This is a 22 by 29 inch or a 55.8 by 74 centimeter kit. Um, if you have never purchased from Diamond Art Club before and you want $10 off your first order, I do have a discount code. I don't exactly remember. I'll look at, I'll look at my phone quick. Um, I can never remember if it's Michaela 10 um let's see you can use the code yes Michaela 10 for ten dollars off your first diamond art club order um and I have the link down below to diamond art club as of the time of me filming this video this kit I believe is in stock still um I will <laughs> I should have done my homework but let's just look really quickly it'll take two seconds um I believe it's still in stock moon girlfriend is indeed in stock still um but again i'm uploading this video in like a week so it might change by then but anyways enough talking let's get right into the kit um i already took the little like shrink wrap off because that's a pain but i'm really excited to take a look at this kit because i'm pretty sure this kit has the new perforated film on the top which i will talk about when we get to it but let's see okay so I have this, this, and this. Perfect. And there's nothing else in the box. Also, you guys can't see a single thing. Let me go ahead and actually lift up this um, setup for you guys. But okay. So <laughs> here we have the three important things that usually just come straight out of the box. So first of all, we have the small sticker here. And on this small sticker, it has the name of the kit, a nice little thumbnail of the kit. There we go, a uh, thumbnail of the kit. And basically, I personally use this inside my um, diamond art logbook. And I go ahead and stick this on the page of, you know, the kit I'm going to work on. Basically, it's a, it's, that's a really terrible way to explain it. But it comes with a small sticker, which I love. Um, so we have the small sticker and then it comes with a toolkit, which we're actually going to go over first. And you know what, when we're doing the toolkit, I'm going to bump this down just a little bit so you guys can see it just a little bit better. But each time an art club kit comes with a toolkit and um, the main difference between the square kits and the round kits in regards to the toolkits is that round kits do not come with tweezers. Um, I'll show you guys actually the Diamond Art Club branded tweezers. These are them. Um, <laughs> they come in square kits, not round kits. Um, but that is the difference. Otherwise, let's go ahead and look in the toolkit. I'm so excited to see what the cover minder is going to be. And just an FYI that the cover minders, I believe soon are slowly going to become discontinued and no longer in kits um, because of the perforated film that I'll show you guys on the canvas. But anyways, okay, let's get right into the toolkit for this kit. I'm always very excited to see what's inside. Okay, awesome. So I like never know where to start, but basically you get a bag of baggies. What I personally use these for are when I'm done with the kit, I put special drills into them because I want to keep the special drills um, and 310s and things like that I want to keep extras of. So these bags are really handy. Um, it also comes with a pen and a matching squishy, super cute color. I don't think I've seen this color yet. Super pretty, a very beautiful pink color. You can just put the... Um, 
that noise is god awful um you could just put the squishy kind of this is hard to do i don't know why i always struggle with putting the squishy on the pen do you guys also find that you run into that problem you know what never mind we're not going to do it because i can't get it on but it comes with a pen and a matching squishy and then you also get um, two multi-placers and um, you can stick this into the other end of your pen if you want to place more than one diamond at a time. A four placer and a seven placer is what comes in the diamond art clip kits. I love the four placer. I like live by the four placer. Um, and then you get some wax here. This is just normal pink wax, except Diamond Art Clip has it in the shape of a heart, which is really cute. Um, and I actually do like the Diamond Art Club pink wax. It lasts a very long time. I have like a growing pile of it. Um, but then you also get a white tray, which I actually used for the longest time, but I have since been using like a little bit of a bigger tray from Amazon. But um, a nice white tray. It comes with a tray stopper um, so your drills don't fall out, but you get a tray. And then the most exciting part, in my opinion, are the washi tape and cover minder. Oh my god, this cover minder is so cute, but let's talk about the washi tape first. Um, the washi tape in this kit is this beautiful floral pattern. Oh, isn't this stunning? That is really, really pretty. And then this cover minder is so stinking cute. I got a little dolphin minder. Look how fun. I'm so glad I got this one. I've never seen this one in person. It's adorable. I love it. It's basically cover minders um, you can use to hold your plastic back on your canvas when you're working on it. So it has a magnet on the back and another magnet that's attached, but on the back. And you put this one underneath your canvas. You put the cute part on top and you magnetize it together and it's supposed to hold back your plastic. Um, I don't personally work that way with my canvases, I actually use release papers, um, but a lot of people do use that method. So anyways, that is the toolkit. I'm going to quickly put this um, stuff back into the bag and then we'll get into the canvas. Okay, so now we're getting into the canvas and I'm just flipping this around. But um, basically, this is the... Um, the canvas and there is um, Diamond Art Club Do What Makes You Sparkle. I was just looking because I think these are like, I don't know, my like dust bag is like stained, but that's okay. Alrighty, let's get right into the canvas. Open up the dust cover bag. Okay. Awesome. I'm just going to throw my trash with everything else. My office is a mess, but that's okay. Okay, you guys, we're going to go ahead and unroll this beauty. Oh, oh my God. She is a beauty. Okay. Okay. Um, and then we have everything here. So I'm going to put this here for two seconds. Um, one thing you could do with Diamond Art Club canvases and canvases that have poured glue in general is you can go ahead is and flip it around and because this canvas is going to come like rolled up basically and it's not going to lay perfectly flat right away. One way to help it lay flat is by actually rolling the canvas the opposite direction if I can even get this going. Um, this does not ruin the canvas, the glue, anything like that, um, but it does help lay the canvas flatter so okay oh my god this canvas isn't even that big and i'm struggling also i'm trying to oh it has the perforated cover on it that's exciting okay but you guys i'm gonna go ahead and insert a clip right here of a pan over the canvas and while i'm inserting that clip um since you guys won't see this i'm gonna go ahead and lift this up a little bit for you guys so by the time i get back you guys can see a little bit more of the canvas but you guys, oh my goodness, this canvas is a beauty. This is gorgeous. So really quickly, I just want to do a little tour of the canvas before we get into everything else. Um, but at the top of the canvas here, we have Do What Makes You Sparkle Diamond Art Club. And then on the left-hand side over here and the right-hand side over here, we have the schematic with all of the, the like codes and everything of each color. Um, and then let's see at the bottom of the canvas. Oh no, at the bottom of the canvas. Oh my goodness gracious. This is, this is fun. We have a small, um, little thumbnail of the image and then we have, um, the information about the kit and then we have, I'm just like looking at the 
the bottom again. We have um, their Diamond Art Club's Facebook information, a 10% off coupon code, and then also over here is just where you can email Diamond Art Club if you have any problems with your canvas or your drills. But okay, that's enough of that. What I'm actually gonna do is flip this canvas over again. I don't, I'm. Oh, I'm so sorry, I just hit the camera. And we're gonna look at the other stuff that's actually come in the kit. So, let's see. We have right here the, um, actually, you guys, I'm all over the place today. First of all, let's start with, with this. We got a thank you note from um, Diamond Art Club and inside it just has tips and tricks on how to diamond paint. Um, and then there's another 10% off coupon code. Um, if after you make your first purchase, you could join the VIP Facebook group, things like that. So you have that and then, and then we have the big sticker sheet and this has a bigger image of the artwork, isn't it stunning? And then it has a spot to write your start and end date. Again, this is Moon Girlfriend by Ivy Dolamore. Have I, I feel like I have mentioned that at this point in the video, but I can't remember saying it out loud. Um, and then we have 65 colors in this kit and these are all pre-cut sticker labels. So you can label your containers, however you kit up. And it looks like, so everything under the uh, DMC system, um, underneath 150 is an AB drill, which is an Aurora Borealis drill. They are just very shiny diamonds. Looks like we have four of them in this kit. And then at the bottom of the list, we actually have a few things here. So first of all, the 6000s you see, um, if you guys are familiar with the DMC code, 6000s don't exist. Um, but Diamond Art Club actually recently created some new colors to kind of fill in gaps in the, um, in like the color system for them. And then we have a K, which off the top of my head, I don't recall if it's an electro or, um, what's the other one, iridescent? I don't recall off the top of my head, but it's one of the two. And then Z is a fairy dust. So we have some really fun special drills in this kit. Um, I just like love, I love everything about this. So that's the sticker sheet. And then we have the bag of drills, which I'm gonna go ahead and open these and then we will go through all of the drill colors together. I also just wanna mention really fast before I put uh, this away is that each um, kit has, it's basically labeled. This is the bag that all the drills came in and it tells you which kit it belonged to. So in case you store your drills separate from your canvas, you can find that later. But you guys, <gasps> look at this spread of colors. It is stunning. Okay. Anyways, let's go ahead and pull out some of these drills and just go through them. Oh boy, these were packaged quite well. Okay, so first of all, we have one, two, three, four bags of 3371. Do we have any 310 in this kit? I'm just looking. Oh, you guys, this is a 310 list kit. It does not have any 310s. That does explain the amount of 3371s. That's why I checked. Awesome. And then we have our first AB drill, and this is um, a very pretty purple color, 119. This color is actually in my current kit, which is Springtime Slender by Randall Spangler. Um, it's gorgeous. Like I said, AB drills, they stand for Aurora Borealis, and they just have a beautiful coating on the top of them. Absolutely stunning. Love that there's a purple. We have two bags of 553. 3839. I don't know why I said it like that. 3839. 610. 6010. Wow, my brain is like only halfway working. This is the color that um, Diamond Art Club created. How awesome. Beautiful pink. 3807. 792. We have our second AB drill, which is 128. A beautiful peach color. 3609. 500. 3740. 3041, 3836, 3835, and 791. That is the first strand of drills. And then we move on into the next little, little strand here. We have 3834, 161, 223, 3685, 604, 153, 106, which is like a pale yellow color. It's another AB, super stunning. 315, 3799, 317, 3362, 844, 3688, 3721, 779, 413, 3860, 336, 
$8.95 and $1.58. And that is the second strand. And then, let's see. I think we have two more strands of drills. Okay, perfect. Um, I'm just, okay, I see the, I see the, uh, one of the specials. I was just like, I don't know where it is, but we're good. Okay, and then we have our fairy dust drill. This is Z341. And basically these drills just have a glitter coating on the top of them, like a fine micro glitter. And let's see if it will focus in on it. Um, I don't know how easy it is to see, but these have a super pretty micro glitter on them. Stunning. 155, 501. 554, 552, 3689, 157, 327, 156, and 924. You guys filming these videos is like terrible for my back. I have no idea why my back hates me so much. But now we have the last strand of drills and these seems to be like the really small bags of drills. So we have 356, 926, 3859, 520, 3778, 221, 3346, 451, 160, 3727, 937, 3803, 803, 152, 3687, 3840, and then we have our, I, you know, I don't, I still don't know if this is an electric or a iridescent. Um, I will look after, after I film the rest of this, um, strand, but look how beautiful this is. I'm very curious where it's going to go, but it's just like a beautiful, like kind of, it's kind of goldish. It's kind of hard to tell. Maybe it is silver. The lighting is making it very hard to tell, but that's gorgeous. Then we have 141, which is our last AB and it's just a handful and it's a white AB. 819 and 453. I'm going to go ahead and put the drills away and we are going to go and look at the canvas and find where the special drills are placed. Okay, so I have uh, the camera up as high as I feel like it can go and we're just going to go with it. Um, but basically what we are looking for, and I'm going to start with the ABs and then we'll go to the fairy dust and the um, other special drill because I think that's just easiest, but we're looking for the numbers one, two, and three. And let's see. Ooh, I wasn't expecting this, but some of the light yellow AB that we saw earlier um, is actually laced into these like lights over here. Are these lights? These aren't really lights. These are like those like moon, like the phases of the moon. That's what that is. It's laced all in there, which is really pretty. Um, let's see, where else do we have ones? Is that it? That cannot be it. Wow, that might be it. Interesting. Okay. I might also just be really blind and have no idea where things are. So my apologies if I do miss any. But um, yeah, that is that is where the ones are, I guess. Um, number two is the like peachy AB. No, actually twos are not the peachy. Two, twos are the purple. Twos are the straight up purple. Okay. Basically we have like twos over here. We have twos in like the wall area over here. It's not all over here, but like basically you see how the wall is purple. There are a bunch of twos to like accent the wall where there are a bunch of twos though is right over here a ton of twos. There's going to be a lot of like, oh my God, there are going to be so many twos. Yeah. In the wall, basically it's highlighting some different things in the wall. Um, I don't know if you guys can see this like shape. Those are all two ABs as well. There's some twos here. Um, there are actually some twos laced in within like here as well, like in when she's holding the mug of tea, um, some twos laced in there as well. Um, let's see. And I completely forgot you guys to show you guys the perforated cover sheet. I will um, give you guys a little closer look after we look at the special drills with that because I just completely forgot it existed because you can barely see it on the canvas. Um, but I don't see any more. Yeah, I don't see any more twos. Okay. Uh, besides like the wall. Okay. Moving on to threes. Three is the peachy color. You guys, I'm so sorry. I'm all over the place. There are some threes within her cardigan, um, which is super pretty actually. Is that a cardigan? Wait, is she wearing it? Yeah, she's wearing, she's wearing a cardigan. Yeah. So the threes are pretty much laced within like her cardigan, um, which is really pretty. 
Um, oh, there's a couple two ABs in her eyes, FYI. Um, otherwise, the threes are actually just mostly laced in her cardigan. Okay, interesting. And then four is 144, which there aren't many of, so I might have to dig a little bit. There are a couple white ABs in her eyes. Um, there's like a couple white ABs in her hair, but it's not many. It's not many at all. Um, okay, there are some white ABs on the handle of the mug. Um, otherwise, that's it. And I'm not very surprised by that because again, there were only a handful of that color AB, so that's not surprising. Um, okay, awesome. Now let's move on to the other special drills. We're gonna start with the fairy dust first, which is the letter A, which was the light blue fairy dust. And that one, just looking at the bottom of the canvas, just to make sure there aren't any. Hmm. I would have bet anything they would be in the pants, but they're not in the pants actually. Oh, okay, okay. It looks like it is highlighting kind of the outside of, um, this window a little bit and then you get like a bunch of fairy dust over here um you get some yeah basically just like highlighting this like window area that is where you're gonna find the fairy dust which is really pretty i'm excited to see how that's gonna render and like look with drills on it um but yeah those are that's actually really the only spot where the fairy dust are that i can see again this is all from what i can see um also peep my homer simpson pajama pants that you guys can see um but then the last one is the symbol of the drill that i have no idea the iridescent or the electric i think it's iridescent i want to say it's iridescent but i don't know anyways um i'm just gonna double check the bottom but i'm pretty sure i know where this one goes um okay yeah i don't see it oh actually there are some um, of the iridescent in like her, what do you call this? Like um, a pant button, that's what you call it. Um, and a little bit over here as well. Um, so it is a little bit in her pants. Otherwise, you are mostly finding it in the jewelry on her face. So you have some in her nose ring, you have some in her earring, um, which is stunning. Like yeah, she has earrings and basically like her jewelry, not her necklace, like earring and nose ring basically are that iridescent drill which is really stunning um and i actually i think that's it i think that's all that is where where it is <laughs> oh my goodness okay you guys that is it <laughs> that is it for this chaotic unboxing i'm sure it's more chaotic in my head than it actually translated to but like boy that felt chaotic but this kit is stunning i'm so excited to work on it and I also quickly just wanted to show you guys, and I'll go ahead and zoom in a little bit more for this, but it's super hard to tell, but you, can you guys see this line right here? That is the new perforated film cover. So basically, I'm not going to go ahead and pull it for you guys because I don't want to mess anything up at the moment, but basically your canvases now, like canvases that are being produced now by Diamond Art Club have a perforated film on them and basically you can pull apart these squares that are already on your canvas and um, it's kind of like pre-sectioned for you so you don't need cover minders anymore. I will definitely still be um, kitting up and covering my canvas and release papers that's just how i work it's how i like it i actually don't like seeing sections before i work on them it just feels more like a surprise to me when i get to a section and i'm like oh i can work on this now you know what i mean um but yeah that's kind of the perforated film there are plenty of youtubers that have shown ripping the um the perforated sheet so definitely check literally anybody else's video out i just don't want to mess it up um especially because i'm not working on this kit for probably another week but anyways thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing video today again i hope it wasn't too chaotic but i do appreciate you guys tuning in if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button down below if you're not already and i will catch you in my next video bye guys